Hey, this is just a quick follow up to uh, my video early this morning, 3 a.m. Uh, there, I talked about the fact that I didn't trust this rally, uh, that the short sellers would jump in and bring the prices back down. And uh, I also said I would wait until noon to change my order to get it filled. Well, I was I was right about the uh, short sellers moving in. We're going to see the prices go back down in the six dollar something range. And uh, but I uh, went ahead and sold eight dollar puts, forty one cent premium. That's pretty good. Uh, but oftentimes I've talked about this whole business being counterintuitive. I mean, we were just trained and maybe our mental makeup uh, uh, says, you know, don't pay too much. Don't sell it too cheap. Uh, and, but we discount the uh, revenue that could be generated by doing just that. So, I wrestled with myself, <laughs> uh, but I didn't want to miss this week's revenue. Um, and let me go to that screen real quick. So I collected uh, $779 in premiums. Uh, so that, that adds to my revenue base. And so at the very least, what I've got to do is when I sell calls or set strike prices on call orders, uh, is be sure the premium for the call and the premium for the put exceeds the uh, capital loss. So we'll see how fast it drops. Whether I'll make that or not, honestly, I don't know. Every time I try to time a market, <laughs> it, it just doesn't work out. So basically this mechanism, uh, if I do have a, a, a loss, it mitigates the loss. So the loss is not so bad. And over time, uh, I make some money. Uh, the other point is that because the price went so high, a full dollar above my, what I originally wanted to set a strike price at, uh, instead of being able to sell 21 um, contracts, I was only able to cover 19. Uh, but still, I got a fairly decent um, uh, premium. So we'll see how this goes. I just have to remind myself, I've been following this pattern for 15 plus years and it always works over time. So, you know, I don't want to fight against the ocean there. Not going to be able to hold back the change. If you're getting anything out of these videos, please subscribe. And um, if you like it, like it and um, notify so that you'll know when a new one pops up. I appreciate it. If you have any questions, put them down in the comments. I always appreciate the questions and suggestions as well.